Hello and welcome to this Proimmune presentation on Pro5 MHC pentamers for the detection of antigen specific CD8 T cells. In this presentation, I'll go through some of the benefits of using MHC pentamers in your research. So, what is a pentamer? A pentamer specifically labels epitope specific CD8 T cell populations which bind to the MHC peptide complex. The pentamer itself consists of five MHC peptide complexes arranged in a planar formation, allowing each complex to contact the TCR, giving enhanced binding ability. The complex is held together by a self-pentamerizing coiled coil domain, and is labelled by five fluorescent orb biotin tags, giving the pentamer excellent bright staining. So why use pentamers? Pentamers are the market-leading MHC multimer, now published in over 1,000 publications. Due to the way the complex is formed, pentamers offer good stoichiometry and uniform bright staining and undergo stringent quality control checks. Pentamers also have flexible labelling options with a selection of labelled or unlabeled reagents available. Unlabeled pentamers can be stored frozen and used over a much longer period, allowing you to use the same batch across experiments. Pentamers also have great application flexibility, not solely for flow staining, but there are other applications that I will describe later on. And there are a large range of stock complexes available. And if we don't have your specificity in stock, there is also an expert custom synthesis capability. Promine also offers expert technical support and advice. Pentamer staining is very simple, with just several steps required to stain your cell sample. After incubation of your cells with pentamer and a wash step, antibodies are added for a further 20 minutes and after a further two washes your cells are ready to fix and analyse by flow cytometry. The unlabeled pentamer staining protocol contains no additional steps, the only difference being that the cells are labelled with the unlabeled pentamer and the fluorotag is added at the same time as the antibody step. Using unlabeled pentamers also allows better control over the staining as both pentamer and fluorotag concentration can be titrated independently and as mentioned before the unlabeled pentamer can also be stored frozen for long term usage. So here is an example of the sort of staining you can expect to see from pentamers uh, using the uh, A0201 MART1 pentamer. We can see here that at day zero there are no, no specific CD8 T cells visible in the population and following co-culture with dendritic, dendritic cells pulsed with a peptide there is a clear positive population as shown in the top right quadrant of uh, the day 12 plot. Pentamers can be used in association with other cell surface markers, for example memory markers. This allows you to determine more information about the specific T cell population. So here we see that the majority of the pentamer positive cells are CD45 RNA low, which is indicative of a memory phenotype. Pentamers can also be used in association with intracellular cytokine staining. So for example on the bottom flow plot we can see how the pentamer positive population is split between interferon gamma high and low and this allows us to have a better breakdown of the immune response being studied. In addition to simply staining and enumerating specific T cell populations, pentamers can be used to enrich or remove specific T cells. Here we can see that magnetic beads with anti-RPE antibody can be used to capture T cells with particular specificities which are determined by the pentamer specificity. This allows separation of the negative and positive fraction of cells and removal of the magnet allows uh, the retained target cells to be released. In the flow plots at the bottom of the slide you can see how the proportion of the pentamer positive cells is greatly enhanced using this method and these cells can then go on to be used for other applications. Proimmune has a large catalogue of stock pentamers, including more than 500 specificities, including uh, over 200 related to cancer, and also many related to infectious disease, autoimmunity, and model antigens such as OVA and beta-galactosidase. Our experienced customer service team can advise you on the best pentamer to use in your study, and can also advise on appropriate positive and negative controls where required. Many pentamers are available for dispatch with, within one to two days of your order. For any specificities that are not on our stock list, for example if you are validating a novel epitope, we also have an experienced custom pentamer synthesis capability. We offer, we offer synthesis on a large range of alleles shown in the table on this slide. Synthesis takes approximately four to six weeks and we also have a rapid synthesis service of 12 working days. Pentamers are available in pack sizes of 50, 150 and 500 tests. Each test is sufficient to label approximately one to two million cells. 
We offer RPE, APC, Biotin and unlabeled Pentamers and most stock items are available for dispatch one to two days from receipt of your order. All Pentamers are guaranteed for a minimum of six months from delivery and unlabeled Pentamers are guaranteed for 12 months. We also offer expert technical support and experimental advice and our PhD trained customer service team will be happy to help with any information you require. To find out more information please see our website where we have a list of customer publications, case studies and other webcasts available as well as other resources. We also have the Pentama handbook which has application notes, protocols and other useful information. If you have any questions at all, please contact us by phone or by email and we'll be happy to help. Thank you for listening.